Hey Gatling, how are we? So this is a sign of the times to come. This is me doing a virtual class with you uh, while you can be in the comfort of your own home, essentially like what I'm doing right now. So if you are watching me live, then come and say hello, please do. Um, I will try and, and say hi back and I will try and see you, but it's quite dark in here, so apologies about that. The workouts that I'm going to be doing this week, uh, hey Hazel, <laughs> uh, the workouts that I'm going to be doing this week will be essentially completely free and then from next week I will be starting my online membership. So I still will be giving you a little bit of a taster and still doing some free kind of workshops and seminars. Uh, to help you with your training while you're at home, help you with home exercise, help you with training without kit, that kind of thing. But my actual big, big workouts that I'm going to be doing in the times that I would normally be teaching will be all part of my online membership package. So essentially that will be up and running and that's going to be $9.99 a week. I'm going to do it weekly because I know people don't want to sign up for a month or six weeks or anything like that because you just don't know what's going to happen. So... I'm going to do a session for you today. Hello, Rachel. Um, I'm going to do a session for you today. It's going to be a nice, quick 20 minutes legs, bums, and tons session. These will normally be, like I said, when I'm normally teaching. Um, obviously, this morning we had the news that um, our classes at Bedford Lodge are being cancelled from immediate effect. So uh, obviously there's a lot of us that are losing a lot of classes. So I will be doing all of my classes. I normally would have been teaching. I will be doing them all on my online membership. Hey Tanya, hopefully you're well. God, I haven't seen you for ages. Hopefully you're good. Okay, so I want you to put your music on really loud. Make sure you've got your music on really loud because I'm not allowed to have my music on loud because I will get axed because of legalities. So I want you to turn up your tunes, put your favorite workout music on, whatever it is that you like to, to bust around to, put it on, you've got five seconds to do that right now. I'm gonna let you do it. Um, and we just need a little bit of space again. So this is gonna be a legs, bums, and tums session. If you can grab yourself a mat, brilliantly. If you don't, then don't worry. Uh, essentially, you can grab a towel, or you might wanna be doing this on the carpet. I think I've got a couple of pigeons outside that are either getting a bit fruity or they're having a fight. <laughs> either way, they're going a bit crazy. Uh, Tanya's put, I know, I know, hun, I know. We might not see each other physically for a while, but we will see each other virtually. So this is what it's all about now, virtual training. And you can redo really this workout whenever you want to. It's going to be in this group forever. So you can just click back on the photos and you can redo really this workout whenever you want. Okay. So again, let's get warm. Start off with our feet slightly more than hip distance. Let's brace the belly, roll the shoulders back, loosen off through our shoulders. So make sure you've got some water and you've got some space. I want to take that arm up and down. So unfortunately I've just taken Benny Bo back. Uh, he won't be interrupting us today, but I can guarantee that he will be on a lot of my videos that I'm going to be doing for you. So again, if you'd like to see him, then absolutely you might want to log in. Good stuff. Okay, let's circle. Round we go. Keep your abdominals braced, and we are going to open up that shoulder. Let's take our squats. Drop and lift. Okay, gang, so here we are. Think about feet placements, please. Where do you want those feet? Do you want them wide? In which case, you're going to be working more of your hamstrings, the back of your legs. Do you want to turn your toes out? And will that work for you? Because that's going to work your inner thighs and your glutes more. Or do you want to have them narrowed to work through more of your quads? I just want to see that. Oh, good, Tanya's doing it, yay! Squat down and up. Have you put your music on? That's the question. How's that music on? Who else have I got on here? Claire, good afternoon, Claire, hopefully you will. Again, I haven't seen you for ages. Let's rotate the waist. Back and in. 
Raise the belly up. Stay nice and strong. So I'm going to try and film live for my classes tonight at Burwell. I've got a feeling it might be the very last ones I might be doing. But hey ho, we're still staying positive. Let's take the legs wide, we're up side to side. Take those legs out. What I want you to do is feel the stretch in the inner thigh. So in the inside of your straight leg. Take a single, single hold. Single, single and hold. And again, single, single and hold. You got it? Here's the hold. One more. Single, single, hold. Open and close your chest. Stretch here. Feel that nice stretch. Open up on the diagonal. Up we go. I want you to be aware of how that feels. Perfect. Squat again. Drop and lift. You've got it. Let's keep strong through our scent again. Pull those abdominals in. And again, press. Really nice. Take a lunge. Right leg, left leg. Now there's not going to be too many lunges or too many squats in this workout today. I'm going to focus more on glutes, inner and outer thigh. Push that forward. Big step. But I'm going to use the lunge to warm up the hips into these hip flexors. Let's drive it through. Four more. Three more. Two. Well done. Reach across. Push. Open up that back. Have a little look where you're going. Think about how that feels. Good work. Four. Three. Hand up. Reach. Big stretch. Let's come forward. Push. Take it above the head. Lift. Let's go again. Forward. Take it above the head, gang. Lift high. Well done. Go again, go again. Push. And then lift. Up. Okay, squat again. Drop and lift. Just that little bend of the knees. Perfect. Four, please. Four. Three. Last two. Well done. We're going to take the right leg out and in. Now, if you need to get support here, please do. Maybe chair, maybe the wall. Whatever you need to do. You are opening up that leg. Out and in. Again, we are working out of thigh. You are also working this supporting leg, yeah? And I won't need to tell you that in a bit, because that's going to be good. So with the leg, we're going to come up with a little bit quicker. Now what I've done is I'm not touching the floor. So you're staying up and pulsing. Oh my gosh. Brace that belly. Well done. You've got eight, seven. Four more. Take the leg in and away. We are now working in a thigh. Across that body. Pull it in. Press. Squeeze it in. And you know what I want to see is when you've done this workout, I want to see your sweaty selfies afterwards. Yeah? Let's stay in a pulse. So you've got to post them in the group, please. Lead with that heel. Excellent. I won eight, seven, four more, four, three, all the way out, all the way in. Out and in. Let's squeeze here. Oh my gosh, great work for the hip. You've got it. Eight, push, seven. Oh my gosh. By the way, how is this leg? Four more. Three, two, What a release. Wowzers. Left leg. Up and back. So you know the score, yeah? Everything on the other side. We've got this. Press. Feel that work for you as you push away. You are lifting. If you can, tilt your foot just slightly. 
Lead with that heel. Again, give me four more. You got two. Little pulse. Push. So this is where you might need to hold on. You might need to hold on to the wall, hold on to a chair, whatever you need to do. Feel that work coming through that outer thigh. Leg comes in and away. It's inner thigh, baby. <laughs> you are working into that inner thigh. Squeeze across. Pulse now. Push, push. Nice and strong, nice and tall. So I am still teaching my classes tonight, gang. Still fitness Pilates and dance fit. It's glow dance fit. Disco balls, no glow sticks, but disco balls in the dark. So if you still fancy it, let me know. All the way out, all the way in. We are going to press through this leg. Open and close. Oh, there you go. Squeeze. You've got this. I need four. I need three. Here's two. Here's one. Back to your squats. Oh, so we use these at that release. So we've done outer thighs, we've done inner thighs. Who's just logged in? Paul and Suzanne and Becca, Amy, hello. Good to see everybody. Hopefully you are all well. Are you self-isolating? If you are, your hands up. Let me know if you're doing this workout. Take your right knee, up, push back. Again, hold the wall, hold a chair, whatever you want to do. Lift and push. Squeeze your butt as you go away. Up and away. Feel that work for you. You got it? You are squeezing highest portion of thighs, lowest portion of bottom. Make that indentation. This leg's working too. Now the leg goes back, back. Little press, push it away. And again, you've got eight. Seven, six, five, four more. Three, two, one, hold. Back to the squats. Feel this. You should be warmer now. Yeah, I definitely am. Here comes the knee. Up, back. Lift and push. Be aware of how this feels then. You are squeezing through that butt. Your body is lovely and long. Now I want you to really squeeze your butt to protect your back. You are not hyperextending. Keep the abs in. Four more. Three more. We're going to stay with just a straight leg. Back and in. Push. Push. Good work. Let's squeeze. Keep it going. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three, two, one, yes. Down and push. Very, very nice. There and lift up. Who's just logged in? Nicola. Good afternoon. Woo. Down and press. Okay, again, adding into the squat. Down, lift the leg. Down and push. You've got it. Four more. Three more. Two. We are going to take the right leg. Now, foot goes into the crook of the knee. Your knee is open. Little bit of a bar move. You're going to up and down. We're powering this leg. Squeeze your butt up and down. So you're working really on the external rotation of the hip. Opening out that thigh. You're working on the outside of your butt. So if you know muscles, this is glute medial, glute minimal. We are working deep. And we're also working this leg too. Let's stay in pulse. Oh. Push it away. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Eight more. Eight. Seven. I need four more. Three. Two. You are back here. Down squeeze. 
Oh my gosh. Down and push. Anyone else doing this with me live? Please give me your hands up. Left leg. Left. Squeeze it. Open. So you'll feel this is different. You'll feel it different from the straight leg. Definitely. As you open this and close it. External rotation. Press there. I'm going to need a shower before I teach tonight. Down. That's it. Push. You ready for your pulses? Get set and go. Push. Press. So obviously if you are training with me online, when I do this for my live workouts, there will be a disclaimer. These are all free workouts for you this week. And essentially you have to take yourself responsible for your own training. I can't see you, you can only see me. So I want you to make sure you're safe. You've got your proper kit on, proper shoes on. You're not in your jammies and slippers. <laughs> and you're working at your level. Let's squat. Give me two. Give me one, hands to the head. Drop, left. Elbow to the thigh. We are opening up that side of the waist. Okay, so we've hit legs. We've hit butt. And it's about our abs. This is one of my favorite moves. And it's a killer the next couple of days. You are really working the side of your waist. We're going to steal on our right side. You ready? Right side. Go. Yeah. Down and in. So if you're watching this on Catch Up, if you're doing it with me on Catch Up, let me know. Tag me in. Make sure you take a sweaty selfie after the class. I want to see it. Down and push. Two. One, change sides. If partners, children, animals want to get involved, they absolutely can. Down, push. We squeeze on the side of that waist. Let's alternate. Drop, left. You are decreasing the area between your ribs and your hips. Crunch. Side of the waist. Down, press. Down and press. Go. Four more. Woo! Three. Let's go two. Let's go one. Now double time if you can, gang. Otherwise, stay with the speed that we just did. Drop. Head stays up. Four more. Three more. Two. One, release. Woo okay, let's get it down on the floor. Who's joined us? Natasha, good to see you. Okay, so let's bring it down onto the floor. We need to find a neutral position for us to lay. So as we lay down here on the floor, let's rock the pelvis forward and back. I'm going to drop that down just a little bit. Okay, so rock the pelvis forward and back. Find that midline position and then hold and brace. Relax the arms. Legs come up, tabletop position. Knees over our hip bones, relax the shoulders. We're going to tap our foot. It can be a toe or a heel. I really don't mind. Whatever feels good for you. You pull in tight through the tummy. Shoulders are open and the head is relaxed. Now the further you tap away, the harder you work. There is no change here. So your tummy stays braced. Back stays strong as you push and as you release. Woo! Down, push. You've got this gang. Stay with me. Four. Here's your three. I'm going to bring my head and shoulders up. Elbow to the knee, go. Woo! Press, in, squeeze, squeeze, crunch those abdominals. Have a little look where you're going and close the chest. I need eight, seven, six, 
and five. Four more. Three, two, and release. Yes, gang. Woo Good work. Oh my gosh. Good work. So hopefully that was a nice little blitzer that we just did there. Hopefully you feel good, you feel warm, you feel like you've moved, you feel like you've had a bit of a workout, which is what it's all about. Nice and quick, super simple, super easy. We work the outer thighs, the inner thighs, we work the glutes, quads kicked in there as well. <clears throat> we worked obviously uh, your waist quite a lot. Push those knees away. Just take a couple of deep breaths. Make sure you've got plenty of water. So again, at this worrying time at the moment, I don't want you to feel isolated. We've got an amazing community. We've got an amazing community group. And we can just bring what we have from live to online. So we can still keep this amazing online community. We don't have to lose it. We still can stay together. You can still speak to everybody in this group. Don't feel isolated at all. You can always message me any questions that you have, I want you to feel like you're still really something, part of something. Take one leg away, have a leg tucked in, pull those toes to you. I think there's a, 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 you know, a lot of uncertainty at the moment, a lot of, it's very scary. Um, you know, people don't really know what to do for the best. Some people are, are really finding it quite challenging to come to terms with the fact that they've got to stay away from um, social events. Now, some people love the fact they are not going to social events. Um, some people quite like, you know, spending some time at home and, and being kind of just with their family. <clears throat> but that whole kind of being isolated away from your friends can be really challenging. It's not great with regards to mental health. It really isn't. Um, and I want us to make sure that we're all checking in with each other and I want us to all stay, you know, really vocal and, and communicate with each other and if you are suffering, if you're struggling, shout out because I can guarantee there will be other people who will be feeling exactly the same as you. Go back to your first leg again. I want you to take this over into the side of the waist. Um, you know, and like for, for people like me in the fitness industry, obviously it's going to have a big impact to our income. It's going to have a big impact to a lot of people's income. You know, not everyone can work remotely. Not everyone can work from home. Um, you know, there's a lot of people out there that work with the public and that's how they get their income. Um, and it's going to be very, very challenging. Um, but... I encourage you to reach out. I think this is a time to definitely work with people rather than against. I would much rather to support my fellow colleagues than be against them in any way, shape or form. I've never wanted to be against them anyway. But uh, I would always support other instructors, personal trainers, physios, you know, anyone out there that wants to reach out. <coughs> Let's bring our legs here. Take this here, you're going to tilt forward and back, and then you're going to come forward and hold forward. Um, you know, so if anyone needs any help, anyone needs any advice or anything like that, you know, please, please get in touch. Um, we're always here to, to offer support and guidance and help. Um, and I will be doing quite a few free yoga, pilates, mindset, breathing sessions within this group. Um, so whether or not you sign up to my online membership, where obviously you're going to get a hell of a lot more, whether or not you do that or not, if you don't do it, that's totally cool. I still want you to have, you know, a couple of workouts from me a week um, that you can do, you can practice, um, you know, in the comfort of your own home so that you're not going to go stir crazy with everything that's going on. You know, you're not... You're not going to just isolate yourself and, and eat your body weight in Doritos or Snapper Jacks and, and watch the whole of Netflix from start to finish. Come up nice and tall. Let's take a quad stretch. Put those into the hands, knees in alignment. You know, think at this time we want to boost our immunity. And definitely ways to boost it is to eat well, eat healthy, eat varied, eat colourful. 
you know, don't try and uh, limit yourself with regards to, um, you know, not eating well. Um, a lot of people kind of go into stress and then they either under eat or they over eat and they eat the wrong things. I think we need to kind of really think about our health, think about our immunity. Um, and exercise plays a part of that. So boost your immunity by keeping yourself well, getting moving, get the body moving. Give your legs a little shake, let's round the back, tip the head down, roll the shoulders forward. In any of my uh, online membership um, offers, it's a weekly membership, you sign up, you can, you know, do, sign up for as many weeks as you want to, it's just week by week, you can stop it whenever you want to, you can start again any time that you need to, so whenever you want, you can, it's entirely up to you, just message me. I can give you the info, give you the lowdown. We'll have a full digital uh, timetable where I will be live. And obviously you get all my online workouts as well. And lots of support via a Facebook group, via a WhatsApp group as well. Okay, take a deep breath and breathe out. Take your right arm up and your left, right arm forward and your left, right arm in and your left. You did it, well done guys. Have a great Tuesday. If you're around, you can come to class. Perfect, I'd love to see you. Otherwise, take care, take greatest care. Love, 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 and I'll see you soon.